and time to start Cyrus I'm hoping to make it to where I was actually no I'm hoping to make it past Cyrus and on to uh Teresa I want to say is And so it was that Atlas Dam was founded some two centuries ago. Indeed, our fair city state is among the longest standing on the continent of Austell. But there was another city state with a history as long and proud as our own. That came to a tragic ruin only eight short years ago. Now, who can tell me its name? How about you, Therese? <laughs> I, um, I think it was. Now, now. No need to get all flustered. There's no shame in not knowing an answer, so long as you have a desire to learn. The answer is in your textbook. Go on now, look it up. Yes, Professor. Let's see. There's more word choicing issues I have here. <laughs> He's just humming to himself. There's one, and granted this is also probably a self-confidence thing, part of the character, of she's looking it up in the textbook, but saying I believe it was. She should be looking at the answer, so why would it be wrong? Why would she have to believe it was when she can look at the answer? <laughs> that is correct. Of course it is. She's looking it up in the textbook. Because it's my issue with him as well, because I also had teachers who, yes, we could have looked it up in the textbook, but he would, most of my teachers and teachers I knew would have rathered us say what we thought it was and then check our knowledge. Even if that answer ends up being, I don't know, meaning that, and then looking it up. But it's a class of two. <laughs> said to be descended from priests of an ancient and long-forgotten religion. On the other hand, our fair Atlasan was founded by one of the original clans that inhabited the Flatlands. Who can tell me how many clans lived in the Flatlands at the time? The histories have it that eight clans did live in the Flatlands in those days. Correct you are, your highness. It was a time of great strife here in the Flatlands, as the eight clans waged a long and bitter war. Change would come when the armies of Grandfort invaded these lands some two centuries ago. At the time, the rulers of Grandfort sought to exert their influence over territories in them. Ironically, this compelled the warring tribes to put aside their differences and unite against their common foe. Oh, but look at the time. Uh, we'll pick up where we left off next time. Don't forget mm -hmm. to read chapters three and four before our next lecture. Voice acting here also throws it off a little bit because the way he's enunciating seems odd. It reminds me of like when students are leaving the classroom and he's calling out to them as they're walking out the door. But they're just sitting there like they were before, so why does his voice and inflection have to change any different than how he was doing the lecture prior? And be prepared to answer questions on any of the material within. Yes, yeah. Professor. Because it sounds weird. The setting makes it seem weird. Thank you, weird for that level of infection. Lecture, 
It's just so very oh. odd. Doing a small search just because, like, there are those three chests down there, and I didn't want to miss any other potential things I could have found. I don't believe the princess. I believe the princess has a crush on her teacher. I believe Therese has a crush on her teacher. some interest in me. I don't want to totally cut that off. But if they are just looking to gain favor or interest with him, then yeah, talking about something that he enjoys is fairly simple. It's a way of striking up conversation. And I don't know if it's been Octopath, just the whole realm of royalty and cast and everything, but I started watching freaking Tangled, and I don't know what put it in my brain to watch it, but Tangled has a series, and it is fairly good. I kind of enjoy it. It vaguely reminds me of the How to Train Your Dragon series, the DreamWorks Dragon that's on Netflix as well. Oh, uh, Defenders of Burke, Riders of Burke, I want to say, and then Defenders of the Wing. I think that's all of them. I think it's been. They don't name them after the actual movie series, which I am so hyped for three! <laughs> How to Train Your Dragon is one of the best animated series of movies out there. And I would say Pixar's uh, Toy Story, maybe a close second, but that probably goes more on nostalgia than anything else. That and apparently they're doing a fourth one, so they've kind of ruined it. Third one would have been a great just ended here. Or even doing like a mini series, like DreamWorks does. DreamWorks and Disney now, technically. So definitely Pixar just should have done that. Because Disney is Pixar now. Oh! Granted, who knows? Maybe that will change. Not in the fact that Disney will not own Pixar in some sense, but in the fact that rather than doing a movie, they could shift gears. It's me, Cyrus. Mostly because I don't see them topping 
the conflict and the near heartbreaking moment of three that would be the that was basically the crux of the entire film so Oh yeah, she said something weird too that annoyed me. Many thanks. Well, I get annoyed by weird character dialogues. Especially when I'm forced to sit through cutscenes because It's odd that JRPGs are one of my favorite series, but I get so annoyed with them just because, like, let me play the game. <laughs> I'll probably never check the try the Kojima games is because I hear they're mostly cutscene. Or at least Metal Gear games are highly cutscene based. So I'd rather play a game. Do enter. My apologies for summoning you on such short notice. How might I be of assistance, Headmaster? That treatise on arcane studies you published. What in the gods' names were you thinking? Sir? I oh, he annoys me most of all, the Headmaster. I'm not talking about your hypothesis. You went out of your way to cite one of the texts in our special arc. And that's the most annoying part of this about this character is. And Cyrus puts it very well later on, so I'll let him take the reins on critiquing him. It is not to be divulged, Mr. Public, at your whim. Laying it bare in one of your silly papers is out of the question. Knowledge should be shared. And that is the point of writing a book. The point of making a video, making a movie, is sharing info. It is for that very reason I would share the knowledge with my peers. This makes me like Cyrus. This is probably why so far he's my favorite. He looks like he's in a fighting stance. But that goes against everything. Enough, Cyrus! Yeah, Cyrus is also smart enough to know when it doesn't matter what he says. <laughs> and that's sometimes the case. Sometimes it doesn't matter what you have to say. Some people aren't going to listen to your way of thinking. How does knowledge have a rightful owner? That's my favorite sentence about this. Knowledge is power. Power is meant to be hoarded. And... It's not a wrong sentiment. But... 
and also a selfish sentiment of not sharing knowledge for the sake of holding it to your advantage. Like, that's the mindset of, like, war. <laughs> My sincere apologies, Headmaster. It won't happen again. Is there anything else you need of me? That is all. You may go. Also, another thing that sticks out to me is random woman in the background. <laughs> Special archives will be closing early today. If you have research to do there, I would do so quickly. Good gods. It's as if you humans watching me suffer. Yes, he does. Thank you for your concern, Headmaster. In that case, I'll be on my way. Test, 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 test. God damn it. Yeah, I'm worried. Okay, I've been fiddling with the settings just slightly because I'm. I listened to it and I'm not sure, so. Apologize if it starts to sound different mid recording. I also did, before I started up this recording, try to adjust the settings to make the quality of the picture a little bit better. I unfortunately have some limits on parts of it, but. It was able, it allowed me to do some more. Can I help you? A moment of your time. My apologies. Say it is not so. Actually. It really shouldn't be easier to steal a crown. It really just shouldn't. Cyrus is a bit of a detective. <laughs> I shall call you Conan. After Detective Conan. Because I'm an anime weeb who still needs to catch- Oh yeah, that's another series I catched up on. Oh, but I still have fallen behind because I can only watch so many of it at a time. Deku Conan is like serialized anime law and art. I enjoy it so much. And this is my favorite part. Scrutinize. Basically, interrogate. That's the guard. 
can also do it to other people. Like this dude. The information gleaned is a hidden item. And hidden items. That's one. Another one. Another hidden item. So hidden items. If you have the ability to scrutinize Chin Li, so you just random little spot showing up with a special item. I don't know if there's any, if there's like specified of doing this one, doing this interrogation or this scrutinize or whatever leads to this hidden item or whatnot. go see the headmaster again. I don't want to. I don't like him, but kind of have to. It was this one? I think. Yes. He has a gate of his special archives. Um... Hasn't used it in quite some time. And he's 58. So. Basically I'm getting everyone's testimony. <laughs> I think there are two more people. I think, yeah, they're both back in the library, which seems weird that they sent me out of the library and then have me start this. But whatever. This basically takes me back to where I need to be. Okay. Uh, hasn't got a key to the archives. Not surprised someone stole a tome, considering their worth. Um, and has gambling debts. And the librarian who despite running the library does not have an, her own key to the library. And she's 21. Um, only the headmaster and the guard stationed outside have the key. Okay. Now, all the information I need to solve the case is who possesses the GDI? It archives and that's of the guard. One belonging to the headmaster, the other to the guards. Whose key was used to unlock the archives? The guards. And Master Key is safely locked away, and he hasn't visited the archives. And the guard, who frequently sleeps, could have had it stolen off of him. Uh -huh. And no, the guard did not steal it. He doesn't care about the book. Which would be Russell with the gambling debts. Which means that. Which honestly, if we're being questioned for the potential theft of an item, don't mention that you have any sort of motive in taking that item. Good lord. But that's just to make it easier. And this is what I love this section, and I love doing all this. 
it's fairly basic and simple, but it's the first one. So I hope there are more like that later in the game of doing little detective works and making it more complex and more complicated with more layers, uh, more people to interrogate. Like this time it's only four. Multiple potential subjects at the end that you can pick from. Um, so you can glean out which one or maybe even have something. Yeah, I am. That whole thing is why that is my favorite. Just this little detective portion. <laughs> and yay! We now have four official party members and then a random tag along because of Ophelia's <laughs> ability. Ah, okay. Equipment. Let's give him something worthwhile. You can use not that freaking pole arm. And I was hoping you could get you one of that. And give you a wooden room. Um, why do you have a buckler? I bought a round shield for a reason. Okay. Skills. Yeah, I checked everything before, so. Off we go! In this area that will allow me to now train Cyrus to get up to a decent level. Ah, oh, Therian. Guiding along so many little babes. Because... Ew, skeletons. Oh yeah, that's the other part that's great about Cyrus is he automatically shows you some of the enemy weaknesses. I will not be back. What next? They should take care of the bat. Okay, that's good. Also, another good favorite part is he has magic. AoE magic. Which I... Every fucking day of the week. <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't just pick that to kill him. He's not gonna hit for dick, is he? Damn it, I should have hit this bat. Uh Killed one thing. Ah, magic. My arrow fly a tree. <laughs> okay, sword works. That at least breaks it, so I don't have to deal with it. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna hit for it, but he actually can. <laughs> Whoops! Forgot about that part. Um, I'm gonna heal wounds. That's a good Cyrus has dick for health, so I don't want him dying. As soon as I can, Therion, you're getting a better sword. As soon as I freaking can. That is a goal. There's three levels in one hit on a battle, so hopefully it shouldn't take too long to grind them up. 
this is sort of why I would love for them to level slightly with the increase. But 